today, we've got Bean Boozle Jelly Beans from Jelly Belly. Welcome to Spice Freaks. I'm your host, Graham Johnstone. Today, today, today we've got Bean Boozle Jelly Beans, another Jelly Belly special jelly bean favorite. Um, I, I find it funny that it comes in its own little box. It says Fiery Five Challenge, uh, and I guess there are five different versions of, uh, of spice level here. As you can see, I've got them all laid out here. Uh, we've got mildest to spiciest. Of course, Jelly Belly always comes out with, with stuff like this. I don't know if you remember, um, they had a, like a Harry Potter one that was gross. It, you know, some tasted like vomit and boogers and stuff like that. So um, I think this is kind of a joke. I don't know. Um, what I can tell you is that um, it's very interesting. Looking at the box here, it says Fiery Five Challenge on the top. Um, bean Boozled Jelly Beans, there's a picture of a, it looks like a kid with his face super red. It says, warning, extremely hot. And uh, it says, how hot can you handle naturally and artificially flavored? Okay, looking at the top here, we've got a spice meter with all the different spicy, uh, from sriracha, to jalapeno, those it says, those are the, the, the milder ones. And then we then move up to cayenne, which is in the middle, cayenne and then habanero. Carolina Reaper is at the top. Yes, there's a Carolina Reaper jelly bean. If you look at the other side of the box here, it says, warning, consume at your own risk. Keep out of the reach of children under 13, the elderly and pets. Do not consume if you are allergic to or sensitive to hot or spicy foods, peppers, pregnant, breastfeeding, or have a medical condition for which consumption of extremely hot food can cause an adverse reaction due to the hot nature of this food. It may trigger asthma symptoms. Do not give to persons except with their permission and only after sharing this warning. So every time you give this to somebody, you're supposed to read this warning. So uh, don't give them to, your, to grandma uh, or, or your dog. We got nutrition facts on the back. Looks like we got tons of sugar in here. 160 calories per serving in the entire package. So, you know, guilt-free. Um, got another picture of all the jelly beans on the back. Um, how hot can you handle? So challenge your friends or foes and dare to compare these wildly hot jelly beans. Five progressively hot jelly beans grow from smoldering sriracha to scorching Carolina Reaper. Can you handle the heat? Take our factory tour. Sounds great. Product guarantee, yada yada. And ingredients. I don't even want to know what's in this. Sugar, corn syrup, modified corn starch contains 2% or less of the following jalapeno puree, cayenne pepper puree, Carolina Reaper pepper puree, habanero puree, citric acid, sodium diacetate, acetic acid, sodium lactate, natural and artificial flavors, special fruit, juice, color added, blue, one, blue, one, and two, lake red, 40 red, 40 lake yellow, five, yellow, five, and six. Lake turmeric, color, multi turmeric, black, wax, confectioners, glaze, and salt. So. Uh, real natural. Although what can be said is that it looks like they have actual puree of some kind of peppers somewhere, trace amounts. So, hey, can't knock them for doing that. So, why don't we start from mildest to hottest? Here we've got the sriracha. I don't know, it's red. What do you want? Let's do it. Oh, man. Oh, God. It tastes like sriracha, but it's sweet. It's so weird. Kind of like, I don't know. Oh God, that's really gross actually. I don't know if I like, I don't know if I'm gonna like these. Yep. Definitely sriracha. Um, spice level on this one, one. It has sriracha flavor though. Give it that. Not super spicy. Definitely sriracha flavor. Definitely sweet. I'm gonna cut. Fast forward in time for this flavor to wear off because I don't want it to influence uh, the next one. We're back. I have had a few minutes to let that other one get out of my system. Time for the jalapeno. The jalapeno is green. It's like a dark green with light green spots. Very interesting. Um, very Jelly Belly-esque, if you will. Anyway, let's get down to it. Oh God. All right, so this one is definitely a bit more spicier than sriracha. I'd say up a spice level, maybe three or four now. Three or four spice level. The flavor, one thing you can say about Jelly Belly is they are very flavorful and their flavors taste like what they're supposed to taste like, which means 
This tastes like I'm eating a fresh jalapeno, which is, which is weird. Fresh jalapeno and with jelly bean texture, and there's that sweet. I don't know, they nailed the flavor, I'll tell you that. But um, I don't know if I like it. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know if it works. I'm gonna do the same thing I did before, give it a few minutes, and, uh, and I'll be right back. Let's get down to the third jelly bean. It is cayenne, cayenne. So if one and two were any indication of a spice level increase, this should be, this should be next level. So uh, according to the spice meter ruler, it is a little bit over halfway. So maybe they're saying it's like a spice level six. Um, yeah, I don't know, picking it up. Um, it's kind of like the other ones. It's a red with light red or pinkish spots. So, let's go. <clears throat> well. Alright, so the spice is there. The problem with this kind of spice, and you know what I'm talking about. We got saliva. And the spice like goes around and it like almost gets caught in the back of your throat. So there's a lot of spice that just is almost like it evacuated to the back of my throat. And it's it's like hanging out there. Um and that's why I would like cough earlier. I feel like I gotta, you know, prevent it from causing, you know, asphyxiation or whatever. So anyway, that jelly bean tasted like Guess it tasted like cayenne. Mostly I tasted like heat and then I could taste the sweet. So it was like heat and then sweet. And that's it. And actually, so the heat was like on um, that one was around the same as a jalapeno, I'd say. Uh, but um, it seems to have vanished quicker. Like a um, lot of heat, a lot of heat up front. And then suddenly it's like it's there, but it's not, it's not sticking with me. Same thing as before. Gonna give it a few and uh, and we'll be right back. All right, a few minutes have elapsed and we are back. So we've got two more left. We have two more beans, habanero, Carolina Reaper. Um, these two on the heat scale here are at the very end. Um, something tells me, something tells me I'm gonna regret my choices here, but we don't give up, we keep going. We got the habanero one, it's bright orange just like a habanero pepper. So, uh, yeah, let's do this. Hmm. Whoa, there it is. <laughs> I knew, oh, I knew it was coming. Oh man, that took a little while to kick in. Oh boy, that, there's that heat, there's that. There's that low level burn. Oh God. Yeah. Oh boy. It, they nailed the flavor on this one. Man, that tastes like I'm eating a, uh, sorry, habanero pepper. So, wow, wow. On this one, on this one, like tons of, tons of like nothing up front, which is, you know, weird. Tons of nothing, very sweet. I was like, oh, it's just a sweet jelly bean. I thought it was like there's carrots or something in there. Then suddenly, bam, out of nowhere. It just sneaks up on you, punches you in the back of the head, and then and then runs off. They they got it. And so one thing I can say is that they nailed these flavors. I'm gonna need definitely a few minutes to let this guy cool off, uh, cleanse my palate, and I'll be right back. We're back. And uh, just a side note for that habanero one, that took like twice as long for for it to like kind of calm down. They did a good job with that one actually. Um, you know, say what you will about spicy jelly beans, but. That one's not bad. Now, the moment we've been waiting for. The Carolina Reaper, the hottest on this scale. The, well, I don't know, I don't think it's the hottest pepper anymore, but one of the hottest. Sorry, geez. Somebody's not happy, guys. We gotta finish, we gotta finish the challenge. We gotta finish the Fiery Five challenge. We're almost there, okay. So this one is, this one is bright. Red, it almost looks like a cinnamon, like it's like a cinnamon um, jelly bean uh, with, um, there's there's like darker red or blackish almost spots on the outside. 
Very sinister looking. Very, very intimidating. Um, this little jelly bean, I think, this could be the end of me. Let's, let's do it without further ado. Sweet, very sweet. Oh, uh-oh, getting this pepper flavor. No heat yet. Oh God, I was wrong. <laughs> it's so weird. It's so, it's so sweet, but like, but spicy. <coughs> God, I was almost like, man. <sighs> okay, it's not, okay. Not bad, not bad, not bad. There was that initial shock of like, wow, but honestly, not as spicy as I thought. Still spicy, definitely, up there. I'd say this is like an eight, probably, an eight level, it's up there. Um, sorry, I forgot to give, even give the habanero a uh, spice rating, probably like, probably like a seven. So, you know, they definitely do stack up as you go. This one, this burnt, it's just like, I feel like it's scarring my mouth. Weirdest thing, you get like these little sweet chunks and then suddenly it's like BAM and you're like, oh God. So definitely it kind of like messes with you. It, you, you think you think the torture's over, but it's not. It comes back, it comes back each time with a vengeance. It's not debilitating, but my body's uh, starting to react a little bit. So uh, I don't know if it's just hot in here, but I'm sweating a little bit. Um, you know, I can tell my like nose is getting a little stuffy. Guys, that's it. I'm not gonna go on and on anymore. Um, so that was it. That was the Bean Boozled. We just did the Fiery Five Challenge. Um, jelly Belly, Jelly Beans. Uh, I think I got these at Cost Plus World Market, one of my favorite places to get weird, spicy things. They're weird, they taste like peppers. Overall experience with these, I, I don't know. I mean, I, I, I don't know. That's all I got for this. Um, anyway, like, subscribe, comment, share. And uh, let me know if there's any hot sauces or hot products that you want me to try out, and I'll definitely do it. Okay, anyway, I'll see you guys around next time.